are social insects like termites or like bees. A single individual is incapable of any personal initiative. All of the decisions are made by the colony. Ants receive a few simple orders such as search for food, mark the path leading to the food, and follow a marked path. As a result, we might have the impression that each ant is rather clever, and in fact, this has more to do with a collective intelligence. You mean that an army of sissies could be intelligent? <laughs> Believe it. Very funny. Shut up, bird brain. Settle down, please. As I was saying, thanks to their numbers, they managed to accomplish some fairly difficult tasks, such as finding food or defending themselves against an attacker. It would seem that ants even wage full scale wars between different colonies. What about killer ants? Do they exist? Well, yes, maybe in movies, Ulrich. <laughs> But there are, in fact, army ants that destroy everything in their path. And it's true that you'd best stay out of their way. And, uh, do any of those filthy bugs live around here? No, fortunately. They live in South America. Down there, the phenomenon is called Marabunta. Phew! I'm glad I live in a country where there's no danger. Hmm. 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 Yeah, well, that would be really good. Yes. I'd like to... Saturday's my favorite day. Mm. No school in the afternoon. I like Sunday's better. No school at all. Hmm. You seem worried, Jeremy. What's on your mind? Franz Hopper's notes, Alita. Last night I decoded a really interesting part on a multi-agent system. It's a computer application that follows the principle of an anthill. What happens is... Oh, no. Mrs. Hearst has already bored us to tears with all that ant stuff. Don't you start now. <laughs> <laughs> Seriously, this time I might have found a way to weaken Xana. Let's meet up at the factory after lunch. I'll explain everything. Well, uh, normally I'd love to, but I have to finish my Italian homework. See ya. Uh, no, I have to practice for a skateboard competition. You mean? Sorry, I've got swimming after school. Bye-bye. What about you, Ulrich? Are you doing anything later on? Yeah, I've got to be somewhere. Oh, yeah? Where? The swimming pool. Right, well, since everyone else has better things to do, I'll just deal with it myself. Okay, here we go. Stern about to dive? Huh? It's 
he okay? Is he breathing? Is he hurt? Oh, call somebody. He looks like he's... He needs mouth to mouth. Get out of the way. Is he breathing? I don't know. Oh. You think? Let me through. I've got a first aid certificate. Yeah. There you go. Good thing I was here, huh? Are you okay? <laughs> now for the moment of truth. Everything seems to be working. Transfer prototype. Scanner. Virtualization. Hmm. Come on. Yes! Franz Hopper, you're a genius! And so am I. Xana and his monsters better watch out now. Hmm. Nothing. Jeremy? Hmm? I have something amazing to show you guys. Can you meet me at the factory? Okay, as soon as possible. <laughs> Great. And don't forget to go and pick up Aelita. Okay. Jeremy's called a meeting at the factory. You coming? I'm not in the mood. I'd rather be by myself. Come on. If you don't come, he'll get mad. Leave me alone. Okay. Suit yourself. Both of you can stay here. Both of us? Yeah, you and your bad mood. Hmm. <laughs> ah, there you are. But where's Ulrich? He's sulking. I don't know what his problem is. Hmm. What's this program? It's Marabunta, my own creation. And what does it do exactly? It's a multi-agent system that functions according to the same principle as an anthill. But instead of ants, we have these little spheres whose mission is to search and destroy Xana's monsters. I get it. While the monsters are getting wiped out by your ants, Xana leaves us alone on Lyoko, is that it? You guessed it. Hey, that's great! But what if there's a real bug in the program? Impossible. Remember, Franz Hopper was a genius. Yeah, that's right. What do you say we go to Lyoka to check it out? If this thing really works, nothing can happen to us. You read my mind, Odd. Go to the scanner room. I'll transfer you. If there's the slightest problem, I'll pull the plug. Promise. <sighs> transfer Aelita! Transfer on! Scanner on! Scanner by Lita! Virtualization! <laughs> you guys are south of the Marabunta. Take the path to your right. Sorry, but you'll have to go without vehicles. I don't have enough machine resources to bring them up. And watch out for the bad guys. Xana may have his hands full, but you never know. Roger, General. <laughs> A crab at two o'clock. <gasps> Follow it. It's headed in the right direction. Have you been crazy about Ulrich for a long time? Have you been crazy about Yumi for a long time? Forever. You've only been here for a few months. Don't you believe in destiny with a capital D? Two people who've never met but who are made for each other? No, I'm not really into fairy tales or cheap magazine style romance stories. I've had a crush on Ulrich since elementary school. I want to go out with him. That's all there is to it. 
if it weren't for that stuck-up uni, I... And if it wasn't for that big shot Ulrich, I... Mm -hmm. <laughs> Shall we go? I'm getting cold. Hmm. Target did ahead. Jeremy, I've got it. I can see the Marabunta. Well, what's it like? <gasps> Pretty scary. I'd ever say it, but I really feel sorry for Xana. I'll uplink you a visual, Jeremy. It's working even better than I thought it would. If you want my opinion, Einstein, you've invented yourself a nasty piece of work. <laughs> seen enough. I want to come in. Yeah, okay, Alita. I'll bring you back. Head southwest. There's a tower nearby. Got it. I programmed it to attack Xana's monsters only! Well, could you program some eyeglasses for it then? <gasps> this can't be right! Did you do something special? No, except for firing a few laser arrows! That wasn't the smartest thing to do! Jeremy, I didn't have a choice! The Marabuta was coming after me! Ugh, how can that be? Unless... Oh, Jeremy, you idiot! It's my fault! It's the virus implanted in Aelita! The Marabunta thinks she's one of Xana's monsters! Great! Nice work, Frankenstein! I thought we had nothing to worry about! I was wrong! Okay, head for the tower! I'll kill the program! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! No! Whenever you're ready, Jeremy! Oh, I can't deactivate the program! It seems that the Marabunta doesn't want to die! Marabunta's become autonomous. It'll submerge everything and everyone in its path. I'll brief you me and Ulrich. Come on, Ulrich, what are you doing? Will you pick up? Wow, that guy can really pick the right day to sit and sulk. <laughs> Jeremy? Huh? What are you talking about? What do you mean at Chattanooga? Marabunta, I can't explain now. Just get your ASAP. Odd and Aelita are in big trouble. Or is at school, but I can't reach him. I don't know what's going on with him. I do. I'll get him and we'll be right over. Hey, Jeremy. I think we lost your monster, but now we're kind of lost ourselves. I, um... Sorry, guys. Take off in the direction, uh, due west. The Marabunta hasn't hit that sector yet. In the meantime, I'll find a way to stop it. Don't blow it, okay? I don't want to end up as chewing gum. <laughs> I was sure I'd find you here. What I need is for everybody to leave me alone, especially you. Hey, if you want to make a fool of yourself in front of everyone, don't blame me. No one asked you to spy on me at the pool. Spy on you? You've got to be kidding. I just happened to be there, okay? Oh, yeah, right. What an incredible coincidence. Anyway, do you mind shelving your ego for a minute? Odd and Ilita need us on Lyoko. <gasps> Jeremy, bad news. The Marabunta got here first. The tower's unreachable. <gasps> This won't take me long. I'll find a way to stop it, I promise. 
And who can you be your own way? At least, they hope they are. for you. I don't get it. That's weird. Uh, I think I understand. Xana knows he can't let Aelita die. He needs her memory. Hey, what's the matter with them? They're protecting me. Aelita's right. Use them as allies to defeat the Marabunta. Ugh, at last. But where's Ulrich? Alone with his pride. Want to tell me what's going on? No time. Go straight there. Uh, Aelita. Hang in there. The cavalry's coming. to go after. Huh? Ah! What is that horrible thing? One of Jeremy's bright ideas. Luckily, Xana's here to give us a hand. The world has turned upside down. Yeah? Hi. I came to see how you were. Yeah, right. When you have a good chance to humiliate the competition, you might as well go for it. Uh, I missed something here? What's your problem? You're my problem. Uh-uh, no, that'd be too easy, Ulrich. Let me tell you what's wrong around here. My being around Yumi forces you to ask yourself a question. A tough question that you can't answer. Here's a piece of friendly advice. Go and talk to Yumi from the heart. Or else, one day, I will. And then I really will be your problem. doing, Jeremy? I'll never make it. I'm really the biggest loser ever to walk the face of the earth. You couldn't have known that my virus would be a problem. Your virus? Virus? What if... Yeah, well, that ought to work. General Odd. It takes strategy, you know. The only thing stupider than a block is two blocks. Yeah! Jeremy, move it. Things are getting a bit out of hand. Hey, I'm doing my best, guys. I think I found a way to destroy the Marabunta. Odd, I inserted a code for a deadly virus in one of your arrows. If you hit a spear with it, the whole will be infected, but no sweat. Wait, it'll only work if you hit the first sphere, the one I transferred to Lyoko that created all the others. It's at the heart of the Marabunta. Uh, great, so how am I supposed to reach the heart of the Marabunta? On a camel's back? <gasps> Odd, it's the only way. Charge! 
Would you mind telling me how to find the right spear in all this mess? I'll guide you. Bye, Aelita. Ulrich's right. The Marabunta's gone, but Xana and his monsters are still our worst enemy. He wants your memory at all costs. Next time you want to play at being a mad scientist, clue us in a little more first, okay? Well, I really tried to, but you all had better things to do. But you're right, Odd, because this time I was a big zero from start to finish. You found a way out of it, Jeremy. That's what counts. Well, if it isn't the whole crew. Well, if it isn't the brainless frog face. Ha ha ha, you cracked me up. By the way, Ulrich, are you feeling better after what happened at the pool? Cool it, sissy. So what happened at the pool, Ulrich? Come on out with it. Nothing. Nothing. What? <laughs> 